It would take a mighty strike from well outside 50 here. Oh. It's working, it's working its way back. Daniel Rioli! He's landed a second blow. Then Curvis grabs out of the ruck, gives it to Lambert. Doesn't quite work out for Morris Rioli. He's providing the pressure now. Will Day takes on Martin. Scrimshaw run down from behind. The Tigers pressing. Oh, oh pack! Dustin. Dustin Martin from nowhere! One of the goals of the year! I must admit, Gary, I went Martin, but I didn't have a great deal of confidence. I had that sinking feeling, but it was. Uh, it's actually a yellow boot here. Look. Bang! Oh! <laughs> Back through Foster. Trying to pick their way through with Gipkis from the stand start. Tell you what, this is this is going right to the line and beyond. And he loves it. From that initial rebound, yet Vlostin goes short, no forward pressure. And a really good strike of the ball. Tom Lynch doing what he needed to do on the line as well. He did a great job preventing him from getting back. The most complete performance of the year by some margin, Duck, when you think about the Blues, the Giants' win was ugly in the yeah. fall away against the Saints. Yeah. I'd agree with that. No, no question. Back to that real Richmond yeah. pressure that they've won three Play chips on. off. Gives it off. It's a long, long ball from a man who kicks a brilliant ball. Short. Goes long. Touched on it before, Duck, but they've certainly got their mojo back. And definitely don't give Jaden Short any time and space when in range. Mentioned it before, Hamie. Hey, he just got he's got this ability just to be out of. Um, hey, Bolton has kicked multiple goals in all three rounds. He's already got one tonight. Now pressed here, trying to thread the needle. And look at the hands, Tom Lynch. It's an area we thought the dogs could be vulnerable and the Tigers with their speed of ball movement and decision making they're isolating those contests one on one Lynch twice in that phase of play set them up with that last forward 50 entry Robbie Tarrant wobbles one down the line gets past everyone then Curvis flicked it up to Martin Martin to Prestia Ross will go back to Prestia by hand short in the middle now and he can go long and through that's big. We spoke about the small Richmond forwards and midfielders that continue to work in and around that contest. They link up, they keep working for one another, they use the handball, and that's how, as Richo said, that's how you create options. Working together, linking up together. Well, Adams jumps high, and Curvis down, belted forward by Martin. Ralph Smith, really well done to Short. And Short can just have a lash at it. What a start for Richmond. Well, this one taking 16 seconds, Daisy. I think the world record's about 12. And as Hodgie said in the halftime break, just... Try to get it to Duggan, couldn't numbers, do that. Good numbers from the Tigers. It was, and they swell forward again on the full charge without the most dangerous Edwards. And now the charge, General Rioli. He thinks he's close enough. He is. He is. He was. He is. It's there. Look how hard he's running forward of the ball. Once you win, you have the license to go. And then no one came up. I think Rotham was the first one to make a decision to come up, and then that allowed that overlap run to continue. One of the great goals of the afternoon, and he had Tom Lynch there if he wanted to drop a 20 metre. Pressed here, waste no time. The Sonsi, who's been using it pretty well. To Nan Curvis, hands it up. To Miller. He launches. Goal square. Needs a bounce. Baker flies at it. He's got there. Miller has launched it from downtown and kicked his first ever goal in AFL footy. That's the power you're talking about, the right. halfback. Right. All of them, didn't they yep. take off? Halfback, we'll see if we can see it in. Look at him charge out of the defensive 50. There's Miller on the right of screen. There's Rioli on the left. 
big neck getting involved and then what a nice finish for your first goal in AFL footy and what a time to do it as well for Ben Miller. Great hands from Sonsi as well. I know we've pumped him up a little bit today with what he's achieved, but he had to hit Nan Curvis perfectly. North Melbourne were ready to, to swarm Nan Curvis. Darcy Gardner. No, Darcy Wilmot. The 18-year-old on debut. Gives it to Danaher. It gets smothered. Chance now. Cumberland on his left. Ball needs to be trapped. Was it Rioli? Small little margins. Suddenly the Tigers get the goal. Morris Rioli Jr. Works his way through, gets a goal, Tigers by 11. For me, the handball around the back to the resting Ruckman, probably not the play they would have been after. Just go back and kick it long to the forwards. But then when you get in a situation like that, Kitty Colvin just got stepped around. And just the composure, Rioli, once he got it there, you wouldn't want to be left one-on-one -on -one with him in the pocket. Already led by 20 points. Nice little hit up for short. He's only just out of reach. Bolton is the deepest forward. He's the hottest player on the field, and he's taken a mark, and he can hurt you in so many ways. Um, clearance or any passage of the play, but then going down here in the most difficult part, and that is trying to take a contested mark inside forward 50. He's do, doing it both. Watch Graham's body work here. He actually did well. He, and look at the shock on his face when he realised Bolton was actually still hanging in the air and able to take the mark. He opens the mouth. He can't believe it. Oh, how did he, how did he do that? Thanks, Jimmy. Matheson into the middle. Cross tone didn't have it. Advantage, Advantage will be paid. Immediately they go. An opportunity for the steamrolling Rioli. Rioli from 50 launches. Tigers are in front. Unbelievable, Dan Rioli. To me, it looks like he's been set the task maybe since half time on camera and he's had some critical wins. And then in this moment, going back the other way. Yes, you can hunt the footy. Got to have an awareness of your opponent. Ryder won the tap that time and only as far as Ross. And they go forward again. Here the Tigers. Bolton sends it towards the square. It might actually fly it over the top. It does. Two goals in quick succession. Tigers on fire early. There it is again. Jade Gresham. I reckon the runner's got to get out. Brett Rutten to Gresham. His starting points at those centre bounces are just off against Bolton. Bolton goes forward, squirts out, and he's the one who finishes yeah. with the goal this time. Sensational kick. It's a one-goal game. On. Everyone is totally absorbed in what's going on here at the moment. Long ball, lit! Oh. <laughs> what a setup! Now to draw level. Perfectly placed he was oh. on the shoulder. Oh, he's still darting around. He decides just to pop it up. Rewalt knew it exactly where that was coming. Nearly grabbed it, Jack. Smith had his pocket pick. Shea Bolton, he couldn't from there, could he? Oh, no! He's done it! He's kicked a miracle goal! Well, Darcy called it beautifully. He didn't deserve to to get the footy to start with, but then to finish on the left foot that far out, the penetration. That, that is class. That's a deliberate shot at goal. And talk about the, that's in the lead. That's not a contender. That's that's the leader right now. The goal of the year. So that was special. special. So special. So it's picket, fence, and the goals. In that order. What a kick!